Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today, I'm really excited because we are doing a what's in my backpack. Basically, school supplies, school emergency kit haul. And I'm gonna show you everything I bring with me to university. Before we start, be sure you like and subscribe and ring the bell so you get notified every time I post a new video. All right, let's get started. First, we're gonna have a look at my backpack. This is the Rip Zone backpack. It, has, it says on the tag here, the tag right here on the front. Um, I got this last year and I didn't get a new one because why fix something that's not broken or buy something if it isn't broken. <laughs> so I got this at Sport Check and I like it because it's a neutral color, it's gray, it has nice comfy backrest and it's really sturdy it's has a nice material and I like the color because it kind of goes with everything and it has a lot of pockets so yeah that's why I got this backpack okay so I guess we're gonna start with the side pockets and the first thing is my water bottle this is the it says tall I got this at Walmart yeah it says tall on it so I guess it's the tall water bottle but I got it because mostly because of the color. It's really pretty and it apparently can keep cold water cold for 12 hours and like hot things for like 10 or so, if I'm remembering correctly. So, so far I'm really liking it. I just got this a little while ago and so far it's doing what it's advertised to do. So there's that. <clears throat> what was that? <laughs> Since I commute to Ryerson University in downtown Toronto, I often have to walk in the rain, especially during the transition from summer to fall or fall to winter, and it's cold rain, ugh, terrible. So I always keep an umbrella in this other pocket. It's just a black umbrella, again, goes with everything. And it's small and compact and I can carry it with me wherever I go and it's light so it's not that much of a hassle to hold in one hand and then when I'm done I just fold it back up and stuff it into this pocket so in this pocket I have a bunch of random stuff but the first thing I have first few things I have is something you should definitely be wearing especially during these uncertain times but are some face masks so I have three here I have this one, a basic one, and a pink one. So this one's cotton. It has like a little filter pocket here. It says, being kind is cool. I got this at Urban Planet. And yeah, it's just a cotton mask. It's, it's a mask. <laughs> and this one is from the same brand, but it's pink and it's a bit smaller for my small face. Also has one of those filter pockets. And then I have a basic black mask, which we all should have in our wardrobe because it matches with everything. But I always keep these masks with me. So, and then next, another important thing you need during these times is hand sanitizer. I have three from Bath and Body Works um, because I hate the smell of like regular hand sanitizer. And I know these aren't as effective as regular hand sanitizer, but I like the smell of them better. So I have peach Bellini, I have sweet pea, and black cherry merlot, merlot, mer whatever that says. And these smell awesome. And I have three because I need three. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, a girl needs variety, right? And these, are, and these aren't the only ones I have. I have like 10 others somewhere around my room. So, yeah. Uh, next. Another one. <laughs> I just have doubles or triples or quadruples of everything. I have two different lip balms. 
I have a baby lips from Maybelline and a Nivea Hydro Care lip balm because during the winter, especially in Canada, my lips get hella dry and then the baby lips has a nice tint of like red in it so it gives you a tinted color on your lips so yeah that's fun and then this last thing yep the last thing is my keys i have a library card on here a little dream catcher thing um my house key The girl can't be more safe. All right, so next pocket, second smallest pocket, I have my wallet, but I have my cards, cash, coins, my ID, my driver's license, all that goes in here. And then I also have my emergency bag is what I call it, a little pouch. I don't know where I got this pouch. I just kind of found it. But I like how it's black, white. Again, neutral, my aesthetic colors. It has a little heart zipper. But unzipping it, the first thing I see is a scrunchie. Because you never know when you want to put your hair up. And it's baby pink, my favorite color. So, next thing is some Victoria's Secret fragrance lotion. Because I hate having dry hands, especially when. I'm walking around on campus. And so this is in the fragrance teas. Um, I also have a hair tie in here. Um, oh, and I also have a bottle of perfume. This is Beyonce Heat, I think. This is the original. And yeah, it's really nice. It's small, compact. I like the fragrance. Yeah, I always keep perfume on me because I always want to smell good. And then the rest of the stuff I'm not going to show, it's just, I think, more hair ties and makeup. Take these off. Okay, and then other things I have in here, I have a calculator in case I need it. But yeah, that's there, just in case, you never know. I also have sticky notes and index cards in this pocket. You would have seen me purchase these in my last video that I posted, my back to school shopping vlog, which you will see in the corner up at the top popping up. Go ahead and click on it and give it a watch if you'd like, if you want to see me shopping. And then the last thing I have is a power bank, because you never know if you can't find a power outlet on campus and you need to charge your phone ASAP, this got you. This got... Huh? <laughs> Yeah, this is good. Okay, bye. And now we're going into this little hidden pocket right here. This is basically where I keep my essentials, my sunglasses, because they cover your face and you know, this is what I do when I don't want to interact with people. And then these add to that and the mask, so I'm basically fully covered. Now, you need earbuds during university when you don't want to socialize. So sunglasses and earbuds are great for when you don't want to socialize. Plug these in and just jam out. <laughs> and then also in here I have more lip balm. <laughs> the Vaseline lip balm. The Lip Therapy Gold Dust is what it's called. And it's like, ooh, it smells nice. That. I also have my eyeglasses in here. I am very nearsighted, so I can see up close, but when I but when I'm looking far away, I cannot see anything. So usually I only wear them at night when I'm driving or when I am in a lecture and I got there late and there's no seats except for the one in the very back. And then I can't see what's on the board that the professor is writing or showing in a PowerPoint slide. So I have these, they are really dirty, so I'm just gonna wipe them down real quick. But yeah. I have glasses, in case y'all didn't know. There's that. And is that it? No, it's not it. And then I have Tic Tacs. I have, this is in the flavor of Fresh Mint. And I usually have a pack of these or a pack of gum in this pocket. So it's easy reach. And then sometimes I'll put one of my face masks in there as well. Now, before I get to the biggest pocket here, I want to show y'all something that's really cool about this backpack is that 
there is a secret pocket in the side here. I don't know if you can see. It's right in here. And in here, ladies, you know what this is going. I keep some feminine hygiene products. I have pads, panty liners, and I think I also have tampons in here. Yep. And I also have tampons because I use all of these. <laughs> You never know when a fellow sister needs a pad, a panty liner, or a tampon. So, those are all hidden in there. Okay, so now we're going to get into the big pocket where all the exciting stuff is. So, first thing I see here is my pencil case. Again, you would have seen me buy, purchase this in my last video. Go check it out if you haven't seen it yet. And I also have all the pens and highlighters I bought in that video. So, I have my Muji pens. My zebra pens, pens, mechanical pencils, highlighters, shitty whiteout. Um, I also have something I didn't realize I would need so much in university, but like I really do. Is a mini stapler. Like seriously, this is such a lifesaver, especially when I forgot to staple a paper at home, and then I go to hand it in and I realize I didn't staple it. So yeah, that's important. But yeah, nothing that special in here. I have my stationery, pens, pencils, highlighters, all that jazz in here. So the next thing I'm seeing here is my planner. Um, this is a 2021 planner and it's a weekly planner and I just started using it. Basically, you start at the beginning of the month by writing everything that's happening throughout the month and then you turn the page and it's a weekly planner basically nothing crazy I'm actually new to planning and planners this year so I'm really excited to get into the planner community the next I have my notebooks and my folders so I'll show the folder first I have a folder in case you know your professor gives you handouts and you need to save them so there's that I got these all at Staples yes. and then I have a five-star notebook. It's just a one-subject notebook. And then I have a pink notebook as well. Both college ruled. And yeah, I just bought them because I thought they looked nice, basically. But I also think it's important to have paper notebooks in case your professor doesn't allow you to take notes digitally, which is what I usually do. I take notes on my iPad. For a girl who was gonna go paperless this year, I have a lot of notebooks because I have a problem. Okay, now to my absolute favorite part and the last thing in my backpack, my check bag. I have a bag and a bag. I got this bag off Amazon in case you're wondering. It's, what's it called? The uh, Mosful, Mosful, M-O-S-F-S-O. -S -S the first thing I have in here is a wireless mouse. In this pocket, I keep all of my chargers. Well, not all my chargers, my iPad charger and my phone charger. By the way, I would usually have my phone on me, but I'm using that to film. But that would also be my backpack. And now in the back, I have my favorite thing ever next to my laptop, my iPad and my Apple Pencil. Can you tell I like pink? specifically baby pink because I have a case on my Apple Pencil and it matches with this. But basically, like my screensaver, I made that myself. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it. It might be washed out. But I do all my planning, all my journaling, basically a lot of stuff on here. And all my note taking as well. And then in this bigger pocket here in the front, it has places for like pens and pencils and other things. But I have my laptop charger. I also have a dongle because my laptop only has USB-C ports and a micro SD card slot. So I got this, so I have more options. And this is the dongle that came with my laptop, so an extra USB-A port as well, and it's white. But that's what's in there at the moment. Now finally, the one and only thing that is the probably the most important thing for school, especially nowadays when it's so uncertain of whether or not we're going back on campus or we're doing class all online. The laptop. 
Now I have the Dell XPS 13 9300. This came out earlier this year. Ugh, she's my pride and joy. I love her. She's all white with a silver chassis. And I love her. She's an XPS, all USB-C ports. And then on the side of micro SD card slot, which has a card in it at the moment that has all my pictures. But yeah, and she's, I love how she's so light. She's so portable. She's really small, like compared to the size of my head. Like the bitch is tiny and I love that. And yet she has all the power. So I love her. I love her so much. I love her, I love her, I love her. I can't wait to start using her for school. But yeah, and that is it. That is what is in my backpack. Now I understand, like I said before, these are very uncertain times. And I know that some of us aren't even going to be going back to school, at least this semester so far. I personally don't know if I will be all online this semester or if I'm gonna be going on campus or if it's a mix of both. I don't know. So that's why, that is why I still packed my bag, my backpack, because I don't know. I don't know if I'll be needing my backpack or if this will, packing my bag will be a waste of time because I'm just gonna be home anyways. My heart also goes out to the people who suffered in the explosion that happened a few days ago in um, Labayon, Lab Lebanon. I apologize if I'm mispronouncing that, but if 2020 can't get any worse, that sucks. And I'm very sorry for those who were lost and for those people who have lost family members who are suffering at the moment. Um, yeah, so I'm very sorry. So yeah, that's the video. I hope you all enjoyed. Like I said, please be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell so you're notified every time I post a new video. I hope you all enjoy it. Please stay safe and healthy and have a wonderful day. Okay, bye guys. I love you.